Hi YouTube, this is The Blissful Wife and you're watching an all natural product review. Today's review is about 100% Pure's Fruit Pigmented Ultra Lengthening 100% Natural Mascara. I've been using this mascara for a little over two months so I felt it was time to spread the word and do a natural product review on it. Let's start with the packaging. So this product has adorable packaging. Take a look. It's silver, it's shiny, and it has really, really, really cute little white vines all wrapped around it. And I have to say that it's probably the prettiest packaging I've ever seen on a mascara because usually you just get a plain black or silver tube nothing real special on the outside and this one has just a little something extra so I really like the packaging next I have to talk about the scent because these fruit pigmented mascaras not only have fruits on the ingredients list but they actually smell like the amazing fruits that they're made with for example there's a blueberry mascara and that's supposed to smell like fresh blueberries there's a chocolate, which is their dark brown formulation, and that's supposed to smell just like chocolate. And then they have a blackberry formulation, which is the one that I have, and it really does smell like fresh blackberries. So the scent is really amazing, and so each time you open up the tube to put on your mascara for the day, you just get this wonderful little bit of aromatherapy while applying your makeup. It's great. They also have a black tea formulation. That's the only one that I'm not sure if it has a scent. I haven't really seen many comments and reviews on that one. But um, it does have black tea extracts. So it's made with you know different fresh extracts but I don't think it has any scent to it not that I've heard I haven't tried that one yet now for their colors each one of their formulas has a slightly different color to it the black tea is supposed to be their blackest black their chocolate is supposed to be a dark brown good for people with fair complexions then their blueberry is black with a touch of blue shimmer so that probably looks amazing on blue-eyed girls and then the one that I have the blackberry is black with a touch of plum shimmer and before I got it I thought is this gonna be a bright purple mascara and then I was also thinking well maybe it's really just gonna be black and they just say that it has plum shimmer because they're trying to you know emphasize that it's made with blackberries which have a plum color I really didn't know what to expect and I'm so glad to find that it's mainly a black mascara and there's just a hint of plum shimmer to it so if you look really closely at someone's eyes if you're up close and personal then you can see a little bit of plum but it's not overwhelming and it's it's certainly not a colored mascara so if you're looking for something that's black with a little bit of a shimmer maybe a little hint of com color but you don't want a colored mascara then this is good for you um, and then of course if you want something that's just plain black you can try their black tea so those are the different colors and now for consistency I have to say I really am impressed with how little clumping this product has. There really is hardly any clumping at all. I mean even if you put on two or three coats of this you're gonna get little to no clumps. I mean that's been my experience over the past couple months that I've been using it. So that's really good because I hate when mascara clumps. I hate it, hate it, hate it. So I'm really glad that this doesn't clump. Then I have to say the lengthening. This really does lengthen your lashes. So if your lashes are lacking in that area or you just want to have them look as long as possible, this is a really good mascara for that. When they say ultra lengthening, 
they're not kidding. It really does lengthen. It also separates your lashes really well. So I was impressed with that. Now, there are a couple things that you won't find with this mascara. The first is it doesn't really hold a curl. So if you curl your lashes and you put this on, it doesn't really keep your lashes curled. In fact, it seems to kind of weigh out the curl maybe a little bit, which I actually saw that in someone else's review on this product a while ago when I was searching around before I bought it. And I am kind of seeing that a little bit myself. So if I curl my lashes, the curl doesn't seem to stay as much with this. So I don't know if, if that is due to this mascara or not, but it just seems like my curl's not lasting as long since I started using this. So that's one little thing. And then the other little thing um, that you won't find with this is volume. This is not a volumizing mascara. It's all about the length and the separating when it comes to this. I mean, you are going to get long lashes and really nicely defined separated lashes, but you're not gonna get that volume. So if you're all about volume and you don't care about length, you might not be into this product as much. You might not really appreciate it. Um, so that's that. Then I have to talk about removal. Some mascaras are so stubborn and they're so hard to take off and remove, but this one I found comes off pretty easily which um, is really good and it's, it's kind of interesting because when I wear it, it doesn't smudge easily. It really doesn't smudge at all. But then when it's time to take it off, just with water or soap and water or like just a natural kind of soap or cleanser that's not even that strong, it comes off so easy. So that's really good too. And overall, I have to say this is a really, really, really good product. It's good if you're going to be just hanging around at home, if you're going to be at work, if you're going to be, you know, hanging with your spouse or friends, or just you want to be comfortable with a little bit of, you know, lash coverage. But I wouldn't recommend this if you're going to a big night affair, like a wedding or a party or something where you're getting glammed up because it doesn't have the volume factor. So that's my review on this. I definitely will get it again for day-to-day -day living, for sure. I love the smell. I love the packaging. I love all the lengthening. I love, love, love the ingredients list and how pure it is and how it doesn't have these harmful chemicals that so many mascaras have because you know that any of this that gets in your eye goes right into your bloodstream. So I love all that. But I do miss my volumizing mascaras. I really, really like volume. So I think for nights out, I will just get a second one. And let me know if you've tried it. Leave a comment or like the video. And if you have other products that you're wondering about that you want to see a review on, also leave a comment on that. And have a blissful day.